Hello everyone and welcome back to this Imperator Rome, Eumina's Footsteps campaign, which is turning out a bit chaotic so far, to say the least. Now we have apparently managed to break free, or um, the Antigonids have set us free. We are still involved in two of their wars though. One is against Dindaria, who is somewhere here and we don't really care about them. But the other one is Galatia. So if we can actually manage to get some troops up there and siege some stuff down we might be able to you know grow a bit which would be nice as always now the other problem is that we do have Seleucids sniffing on our borders here at the moment now we do have a truce with them until if i can find us trust me we do have a truce <laughs> somewhere please okay we do have a truce in any case, um, I do think, since they are willing to take an alliance, I think we will do just that. So, let's offer an alliance, and then we can also look at possibly Im improving relations with them for now. Obviously, this is only temporary, but there you go. We apparently have another trade route here. Um, I thought we had spices. No, we lost both spices now. Okay. Interesting. Um, yeah, that's not a great deal. We can't get precious metal, so I guess we'll just go with spices for now. It's better than nothing. And then we want to march you up. Now, I'm not sure whether we'll be unblack flagged if we go into the Antigonids kingdoms here, because we are technically on the same side in a war. So let's just make sure. We circle around that and then yeah, get back home and we'll see. We do have a bit of money since we managed to siege down all of these things. So worst case scenario, we can rent some mercs. Been curled up. Yeah, yeah. We knew that much. Which means we are going to hopefully be able to claim a bunch of their land as soon as possible. Now, I don't see a Galatian army anymore. Is that occupied? No, that's occupied by Thrace. Okay. So, maybe... <clears throat> I mean, we do have the Dindarian army over here, but surely... Surely the Galatian army should be hiding somewhere here. Have to see. At least we are making a bit of money at the moment, which is very nice. Academy has been built. We do have money to build more things. Well, we're still building at the moment, so we don't need to do any more construction. That's good. just going to be placed in the queue anyway. Okay, we did get tax collected murdered. Okay. Very nice. Apparently that has pissed off a family and we no longer have a researcher here. Do we have... We do have you. Who's a polymath. I'm actually going to put you there and instead we can probably swap out some... I mean we could swap you out if needs be. Could swap out one of you as well here. Uh, what do we not care about that much? Taxes is kind of useful. Uh, we could swap out one of you as well. What do you provide? Eh, this doesn't really matter, I'm sure. There we go. Put you in charge. Basically the same anyway. <clears throat> okay, we did get unblack flagged here, which is... We can't go through here. Alright. That's a rather large army. Good news is that the uh, Pergamon has been created. Okay. They seem to be slightly thick. Now, I have a feeling that if we actually start coming up there, they'll probably start doing something sensible. We could take you and... No, you we could take and you without actually sieging anything. Defender controls the province of Phrygia Paroea. Who's actually attacking who here? We have zero war score. We could just swipe in and assault this one down. 
Um, what's their enthusiasm at? That might actually be enough. Just crush them completely. We'd lose probably all the manpower we have, but maybe it is tempting. Alliance from Macedon. Um, Macedon is... Hmm. Who are you at war with at the moment? You are at war with Galatia, which is not really going to help us. You're also allied. No, no, I don't think we need an alliance with you. Or do we? Antigonids are being wrecked by Dindaria over here. I mean, they're not... Macedon does have a bunch of... No, no, no. Let's not do this. We'll decline this because... Selekids are touching tips with them, so... It feels like a bit of a dangerous thing to do. Okay, um, what we should be doing, though, is influence. Just to get some more political influence going. We probably also should fabricate some claims here. What do we get in terms of claims? Um, this is just a bunch of Armenian stuff. Need to be at peace. Persian claimant. Need a rebellion against the current... Oh, this one is for that one, going native. <clears throat> uh, medium partner. Selected ultimatum. I believe we were going down this route, right? Are we going with strength with nobody? Okay, we can apparently do that one still. Nice. Send the gift to our overlord, but we don't have an overlord. Yeah, I think we're going right now because, well, I mean, we don't have an overlord. It's a bit tricky there because there's usually not a great deal of chance for ye old, um, what you call it, thingamajib to manage that. Um, we now need... What is it we need? Marketplace buildings. <clears throat> okay. Ha. Huh. I mean... I guess we can get rid of the aqueduct for now because we're nowhere near the population cap. And sure, let's just plonk you down. Right. Uh, we do need more import routes though. So I guess we can get spices. Very nice. I've almost managed to... Get back to our territory. Good news is that at least we have been recovering morale as we've been walking. So if he's just going to stand there and suffer attrition, let's just march over there and see if we can prompt a reaction from them. Bad research ratio. Yeah, yeah, I know. Thank you, game. Thank you. I'm well aware. Um, how are we doing in terms of getting close to... Oh, uh, God. We're so dumb. Washed out roads. Lose three stability and lose money. Oh, good. Good. I mean, this is perfect. Thank you, game. Two stab losing events in a row. I am more than happy to enjoy these, the fruits of our labor. All right. Get your ass over there and we'll see what's what. He's apparently just standing there now. He is at war with the Antigonids. So that is not the issue. I don't know what the heck he's doing. Down to medium. War goal minus 15. So yeah, so we are technically winning. I'm tempted to just assault this down. <clears throat> Let's see. If he actually reacts to it, if he lets me siege it, we'll just stand there and siege it forever and ever. Which he apparently is going to do. I think the AI is broken here. Or is desperate to get the war. Okay, there's another 13k. Uh huh. Okay. We can't get out in time. 
And we're definitely not going to... Well, excuse me, it's only one. No. <clears throat> okay. We do have... Can we win this? Not with these terrible rolls. Let's just check. No, no. Let's just get out of there. We killed slightly more troops. Okay. What we could do is hire some mercs here. Five ducats per month. We can almost afford it. How much are these ones? Five ducats per month as well. It's a bit risky, but okay, sure. Let's go for it. Get you reorganizing for now. And just to see whether we can go and assault with you. This is going to lose us a ton of money though, but it's okay. He has apparently managed to march somewhere, which is less than ideal. Uh, you are getting over there. Give you one more tick, I think. You can stay there. Move you over here. Give you a recovery tick. I can give you a recovery tick as well. Okay. Get you going there, get you going, at least there, we'll see. Okay, he is going for my fort now, yes. It's not good. He still hasn't got the war goal though, so... If we can get that going first, we'll be fine. He's not going for my fort. Maybe he's responding to this one here. Okay, um, was that his, the rest of his army over there? In which case, can we sneak through here? Let's just check. I am very tempted to assault with this one, though, and we'll probably do that. We do have a fort in all provinces, so just occupying the capital isn't going to help him. 11, 10, 5, 7, yeah, let's... Hang on. Here's something. Let's just send the poetes. If you can get a breach there, I will be all over it. Food shortage, not what I was after. Envy of the Antigonid Kingdom. Gain a claim, you say? That sounds great. We should actually be fabricating. Oh yeah, we're also supposed to be... Um, not fabricating a claim, I would like to... Improve opinion. There we go. Claim. Do I have claims? War without CV. No, alright. Well, let's just get some claims going just because we can. There we go. Okay, 7%. He does have some armies faffing about down here. We technically have one war score. Oh, shit. They managed to get the war goal. That is not good. Still, if we can get his capital down... 21 ducats. That sounds fine. I'll take the money. Just to keep the mercs going slightly longer. Okay. There's 2k of theirs faffing around here. That's okay. Great. That is a 26k army standing there. 221 troops. You know what? I think we're just going to assault here. And the war ended. Of course it did. Well, that is typical. 
In which case... Well, we can't stand these troops down now. Ah. Uh. How about we fabricate on you as well? Because we don't have any claims on anything at the moment. Uh, we do have a ton of war exhaustion though, which is very nice. So what we can do just to sort ourselves out is get a bit of the vulture going. Very nice. And then hope that this end... Can I sue for peace with you? Or... Oh, oh, tomorrow. I'm offering peace. Jesus Christ, you won't give up, really? Or you won't let me just surrender? Alright. Friendship with you, yes. I will become friends with you. That seems like an excellent choice. Um, we need more marketplaces there, so let's get that going. Yeah, I guess you're just standing there for now. Who are you? You are underneath the Sally Kids, I presume so is you, yes. Do we want to fabricate a claim on you? Yes, I do think we do. Get a claim going for your capital. Because we're definitely going to come back. You can't sustain all of these troops forever. Crisis in Macedon, alright. That's a good thing we didn't ally them then. Now, we do have Pontus coming up. Pontus is allied to Armenia, which is a bit annoying. Could potentially alpha strike them regardless. So we need one more. To get this one, we would need... I mean, we can get rid of a f library, I guess, but I don't like the idea of that. Still, we do need the fort for this one, so I guess the library will have to go. I mean, it's not like 5% of nothing is that much in terms of um, research anyway. How are you doing in population, by the way? It is very tempting to regional power plus 8%. We could integrate another one military service minus five percent does that do oh no that's law right yeah military service okay levy size multiplier levy size yeah yeah Gives more happiness to integrated culture, though. Which kind of makes me want to integrate these ones as well. That will make things easier for sure. Still only have the four freaking Macedonians going. Uh, what are we running here, anyway? We're running conversions, so there is that. Um, how are we actually looking in terms of religion? Uh... Do we have any? Well, we've got five. We managed to convert one person so far, so... I mean, that is definitely something. What is the war goal here? Mine's... Oh, he's got the freaking war goal, whatever that is. Can you just surrender in this war, please? I don't... I'm offering you peace. I don't want to cede any territory to you. Uh, don't be ridiculous. You know what? Fine. Let's go with this. Need to do something. That will give us a bit more into levies, or should do at least. Marketplace has been built, so we do need one more now. Um, I guess we are going to get rid of the library then and get you going. Is there anything else we need for that one? Uh, we need the territory income to be greater than 0.5. Um, so, income... 
tax income? Oh god. That needs to be quite massive then. Civilization level, pop assimilation speed, local based trade routes, local based trade routes, the true weather of the soul. Civil war in Macedon, okay. Can I please get out of this war or finish a claim? In which case we can just go and attack. Oh, this is the Macedonian revolt now. Which has unfortunately meant that our stupid claim fabrication has broken down because we should fabricate on you as well. You just need something. But yeah, that's the annoying part, because now this belongs to the Macedonian Revolt, so all our progress in terms of getting a claim sorted. I'm not going to... We don't care about Galatia's opinion, we are going to wreck them. Oh my god, they're being occupied by Egypt now as well. Uh, da -da 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 -da, some families... So now this becomes a great family? Oh my god, you're all terrible. How about you? Senonida. They're all Senonidas. Okay, Apollodros. There we go. Oh, good. We're going to have a civil war now because you... Are you the only disloyal one? Yes, you are. Let's bribe you then. There we go. Actually, we can just give you free hands as well. No problem. <clears throat> then see what's what. So you're about to get wrecked by Egypt here, which is nice. Um, our truce with you is up when? 61. Okay, so it's almost there. Rising from obscurity. What the heck is going on? Why are we getting... Well, let's just get with... Hierax. And apparently... Okay... Not entirely sure what happened there, but fine. We'll get some officers sorted for you. You are pretty garbage, so let's put this one in charge there. And we don't really care who's in charge here. Actually, you're the one who's got... Let's swap you out for them. There we go. Now everyone's happy. <clears throat> So if I was to attack Pontus, we could call in the Seleucids, uh, who should be able to wreck Armenia. Which seems like a sensible choice to do, so we can definitely do that. Uh, more trade routes? Yes, please. So with that, we do have spices, we have stone, we have apparently vegetables. Should we get something... We can go with olives just to improve the happiness of our slaves. Uh, let's start working on glass. Instead. Okay, we're no longer at war. Right. You, my friend, disband all the levies. Okay. We now need to wait until January, but that's okay. Should bump up our research slightly. We do have a war goal against Pontus now as well. Um, so this is just tax income here. I guess that's the only income that's relevant. Oh, we need more nobles there as well. Well, we are supposed to have a ton more nobles there, so they should be promoted eventually. Now, we can just declare war on Pontus. I think calling in the Selicids should cover Armenia there. We just need to be a bit afraid of their army when they start marching over, but we should just be able to go there and attack that one. Although we need to wait to January now to actually be able to um, attack them. Or raise our army, rather. 
Alliance from the Macedonian Revolt. No. No, the answer is no. I am going to attack you and take all your land and live long and prosper. And until then, you are just going to sit there and suffer. Okay, when can we raise our armies again? Doesn't tell you there. We lost a bunch of troops, apparently. Which is, you know, less than ideal, but hey ho, what you gonna do? Now we can raise them. Alright. 9k troops. Wait until next month, and let's go. Honored Military Alliance. Very good, so... They should be on our side. Okay, perfect. With that, I am going to call this an episode here. As always, thank you very much for watching, and I will see you in the next one.